welcome to day four of our little getaway to Mallorca. I am feeling extremely nervous today because I've got on this, um, the dreaded scary swimming costume. <laughs> And I'm so nervous. I literally brought my blue one that you've seen me in for the last two days. This one, which is the scary one, and another scary one. I got two scary ones. And I've never worn a costume like this before in my entire life. I feel sick at the thought of taking off this onesie play suit thing. But I need to because this office offers me some protection up here, which is where I feel like I, I was burning yesterday. My other one doesn't. Anyway. It's just coming up to 9.30 and we are about to go down and get some breakfast. Check out the sass! <laughs> Check out my sass! No, <laughs> you, my sass! You're all sassy spuds. No, that means um, Do you not want the top on, Wizzy? Put your vest out. No, sorry. You sure? Yeah. yeah, but when you get wet, you're gonna have to put that on. Whoa. No, we're going down for breakfast. Oh, yeah, hey, that's a good idea. I'll show you what's outside our hotel room. Don't forget the key, babe. I'm yeah. the inside. What, darling? I'm the inside our elevator Does anybody else's children argue, who, argue over who presses the button on the elevator? Right, so we come out. We've got a bit of seating area. Oh, it's gone dark. Over there. And then... Oh, look how high we are. We're high. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's have a look. Ooh. Oh my gosh, that makes me feel so dizzy. What's up, man? I feel so awkward right now, it's unreal. Why? Yes, I do. <laughs> you look amazing. Don't you be zooming in on anything. If it, was like, <laughs> if it was like that, I wouldn't feel so bad. It looks amazing, oh, babe. The belly's out. You okay, look I, I feel even worse that this is going on YouTube. <laughs> We've made such a big deal about it, everyone's going to be like... I, do you know what it is? I feel like, yeah? Okay, I had to say to Isabel this morning, Isabel, if you were going out with me with your friends and I wore this costume, would you be embarrassed? And so I was like, no, why? Uh, okay, maybe I'll put it on then. Do you know what it is though? It's because I feel like an 18 year old, or like I'm trying to be an 18 year old, when really I'm a 32 year old mum. With three young girls, I probably shouldn't be wearing costumes like this. A 32 year old hot mum. A hot mama. You love me. <laughs> so Chris just uh, came over to film in my swimming costume. As we've made such a big deal about it and realised he forgot he had his shoes on. <laughs> so he's got no shoes for today now. Nice one. <laughs> so we've just come down to the pool for probably about an hour and the girls are just all having fun in the water, playing around. As you just heard, I am feeling super self-conscious in this new costume, but I don't care. I'm on holiday. I'm braving it. We're just gonna stay down the round the pool for about an hour. I think we're going to spend the day. Hi, sweetheart. At Chris's auntie and uncles. They're staying just down the road, not far at all. And they've invited us over to their hotel. They came here yesterday, as you guys saw, if you watched yesterday's vlog. They came and spent the day with us. And today is their, is it their last day? They yeah, go home yeah. tomorrow. I'm not sure what time, but today's their last full day here. And they've asked us if we would like to go down and spend it with them. So we're going to do that, aren't we? We're going to take a bus journey. We're going to go take on a bus. Take a bus to their hotel today and check it out. See some scenery of Mallorca. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. Maybe. So we're going to do that today. And then what we're going to do later? Not sure, not sure what the rest of the plan is for today. That's the good thing about being on holiday. You don't really have plans. You just go with the flow. It's another oh, really hot day. Me. Okay. <laughs> it's another really hot day today. Esme and Anna have got their UV suits on and even Isabel today has got one of Chrissy's t-shirts on because you can just feel how hot the sun is. So we're all covered up except me. But I do have factor 50 on. Chris just reapplied for me. There you go, my love. Thank you. Of course you can, darling. Yeah. Why don't we share mine? Because yeah. by the time you get to the bottom of these, it's all melted and warm. So you might as well share it. Yum, yum. We've never been on any other all-inclusive holiday, and we've been on quite a few. Like so do slush puppies, like no, never. slush. We went to Cuba, actually. They did them orange ones on the beach. But not around the pool. Not where you could self-serve it. Not where you can self-serve, yeah. And these are so yummy. They've got bubble gum, which is this one, a blue raspberry, a cherry and a cola. 
Yeah, yeah that's like right. That. It's so good. Are you having lots of fun today? Yeah. Been playing with your new friend, Isabel. Same as Isabel's name. Yeah, that's right. Oh my gosh, look what I've got. Sarah's been mozzied. Massive mosquito bite. Yeah, you definitely got mozzed last night. I told you, like, they get me every time. There wasn't any every in the room time. though. Maybe it was when we were walking or back from the beach or something. If you guys know how long it takes a mosquito bite to actually bite you and then for the big lump to come out like that, let me know. So I want to know if it got me in bed last night. If it got me in bed last night, that means there's a bad boy in our bedroom. There's one lurking somewhere. Yeah. I didn't hear no and buzzing I'm, though. No, I didn't. And I'm not sleeping in our bedroom with a mozzie. <laughs> Yeah, go on. You crazy girl! You've lost the plot! And I actually had to get it on my head. Yeah, because your cat takes all the all the hits. So you don't come on holidays like this because we never see the girls. No, we don't. I'm like saying so like, girls, let's play. And Isla goes, I'll play with you, mummy. Esme, Esme and Isla are just with the friends over there, they're not following. Uh, Esme and Isabel. And we all hear a loud bang in a minute and that thing's popped. And Sarah's screaming because she's drowning. <laughs> so we have to cope with guys, no wonder I'm so underconfident. <laughs> I'm only messing. I know. Right. <laughs> we'll go like that and then just fall back. Try it. <laughs> yes. In. Did it! <laughs> Let me in. See ya. Yeah, baby. Oh, I just did it too. Hey, babe. Is that nice? So I pull you. Look at you and mummy together. That's so sweet. Look at you guys. This is the life I'll array. Eh? <laughs> I'm just bothered to pop the balloon. I didn't. I'm just happy. I'm just bothered to pop it. <laughs> Shut up. You were never going to pop it, fool. Thank you, Isla. I look like Spotty Face. No, she said butterful. She did not say butterful. She said beautiful. We just came back up to the room, it's around 2pm, we just come up for a little bit of time out of the sun because at this time of day it gets really, really, really unbearable. We just come up, spent a couple of, I'm going to say a couple of hours then, it's definitely not been that long. Spent a bit of time up here and now we are just getting ready to head out. I actually do look like, I've got a boy face. Uh, to get the bus, to go meet. Uncle Mike and Auntie Galenda. Whilst I was looking over the comments last night, there was quite a few of comments saying things like, Sarah, where was your dress from? Where was Isabel's bikini from? And things like that. So I thought it would be way easier for me to just do a really quick, this is what I'm wearing today and this is where it's from. And that's what I'm going to do right now. Hat is from Matalan Girls Range, which I just told you, and it was five pounds. This, what I am wearing today is a play suit. This was from, Primark and it was around £10. I really like it because it's a play suit instead of a dress and it's really thin and really cool. So I love this. Little two girls are wearing a little dress, dress from, from Primark. No darling, that one's from H&M. H&M and these are £2.99 which is a bargain. Really cool for the girls. And finally, Isabel, her mermaid bikini that she's got on today. That one is from Matalan. Her vest is a three set, pink, white, and uh, mint Black. green. Oh. And that's from Asda. And then her shorts, these ones are from Next. And that's it. Her shoes were from Home Bargains, and they were four pounds. And mine, the cheeky boys, were from Primark. <laughs> and they were four pounds too. That is mega beautiful. Isla just went, do you think it smells like dog kibble? <laughs> like dog kibble? Like dog kibble? 
Girls, stand at the side of that church so I can get a beautiful picture. So we just arrived in the beautiful Puerto... Uh, Palencia. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry to everyone watching this. I'm so bad. Puerto, Puerto Palencia. Palencia. Palencia? Puerto Palencia. <laughs> just hate, just hate on me all you want, guys. Anyway, we've just arrived and um, we're meeting my uncle and my auntie again. It's so beautiful here, literally. The oh, scenic good. scenery on the way down here was insane. That church is so beautiful with that mountain backdrop behind it as well. It's like a drone dream round here. Did you That's all I'll say. I did this morning. I went, I can't wait to say, see Auntie and Glenda. Auntie? I went, uh, not Auntie and Glenda. Um, Auntie Glenda and Uncle Mike. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Anyway, we're here now, so. Hola. It is so hot. It is. It's so hot, but it's insanely pretty around here. I love this house. It's so funky. It's so nice. It's so random, so but we're taking a walk along the seafront right now, along a harbour and it's so pretty. The beach looks gorgeous, the sea looks gorgeous and I'm absolutely dying to get my costume on and get on it. Oh my gosh, look at this bad boy. Uh, Some really cool architecture in this place. How much do you want to go jump in that sea, Isabel? A lot. I'm telling me too, a lot. Just swallowed about half the pool when I jumped in then. <laughs> it's a bit chilly, kid. Oh, it's nice lovely. Out. It's refreshing. It's very nice. Has maybe been really dangerous. What's she doing? As usual. <laughs> Where is she? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Come on, Esme. <laughs> yeah. Esme, you dangerous. <laughs> Go on, girl. <laughs> so, we are just, what's this hotel called, Glenda? Hobby Club. We're yeah. just at Hobby Club. This is the sister hotel to Uncle oh, Mike and Auntie Glenda's hotel. And one they can use with the pool. And it's so peaceful and quiet. It's kind of different to where we're staying, because we're staying all inclusive. I think these are apartments. It's a fine. It's so nice though. It's really quiet though. And our girls are just used to shouting, Isabel, come watch me do this, mama. So we're just having to tell them to keep their voices down a little bit. That's really unflattering angle, baby. Like literally showing everyone my brain. You um, look good. But yeah, they, I love these sunbeds. Look how nice they are. Yeah, nice. Literally in the water. There is in the water. And the girls can just play here. It's such a nice pool as well. And the best bit about it is, you literally step across the road from the pool and you've got this. This absolutely beautiful beach that's lined by some of the most stunning mountains I've ever seen anyway. So gorgeous around here. <laughs> <laughs> you having fun, boo-boo? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Auntie Glenda! Come on! Come on! <laughs> hey, old Mick. <laughs> me, I love me. Girl, I need you. How many times do I want to hear? You can be so <laughs> the heat was too much for my little Isla. So she's gone to sleep. <laughs> boo boo. Boo boo. It's time to wake up, my darling. <laughs> She's like a little mummy. So, we've just come to a beautiful beachside restaurant. Chris is just there trying to work out our camera because it seems to have a big blurry blob in the middle when we record, and we're hoping it's just water or something that's not condensation that's got inside the lens because. That would be quite bad. But anyway, yeah, we're just going to sit down here, order some dinner, have some drinks. It's absolutely beautiful here. We're just sat there and check out the girls. Check out this sand, guys. So beautiful. You're digging holes, girls. You're trying to find the sea? No, That would be there. No, I'm trying to make a seat. Oh, trying to make a seat. It's so pretty here. This beach is beautiful. This is a different beach to one that we were at yesterday. The sand is different. It's like more hard and rough. The sand's a bit rougher. Yeah. It's hotter. Hotter. 
It's gorgeous. Taking off in five. Taking pictures of the streets here to keep them in mind. Getting ready now. Yo, babe, that steak looks massive. That looks so yummy. That looks really good. Oh, look. I'm so, I'm so hungry. So good. Cut it open, let's see how medium it is. It looks like I've got a massive meal here. And then I've ordered a side. Brilliant, thank you. Thank you. And then I've ordered a massive side of chips. That's not mine. That's mine. <laughs> yeah, I got steak. It's got massive pepperoni pizza. Yeah, boy. And the girls got a big that looks gorgeous. cheese and ham pizza to share and chips, obviously. Which I'm going to start out for them right now. Put your steak open, let's see how, how medium it is. Oh my that gosh. steak looks so good. You can already tell it's a good one. Ooh, that's perfect. perfectly medium for you actually, isn't it? That is perfect for you. So yummy. Cheers! Woo! Absolutely smashed. Smashed, <laughs> smashed, smashed, smashed! <laughs> Pretend that I'm dreaming I smell your breath Not listening But I still hear you screaming Going under One step away Till you hear what I'm saying Sounds like thunder And the clouds are closing in You see I know this But the last days in real life I've noticed Losing focus Breaking up from our life as we know it if so It's just coming up to 8pm and we have had to say goodbye to Mike and Glenda as our last bus departs where we are right now at 9pm and we've got a bit of a walk back up the harbour to where we get on the bus but to be honest I think we're all ready anyway aren't we? Yeah definitely It's been a super lovely day It's really pretty around here and it's really nice to be able to go to a different part of the island is that right? The different part of the island. A different, even though it's only just literally around the corner. It's still nice to come to a different part and experience it. My face looks so red in this camera. <laughs> I think it's the that. light. No, no, I think it's the light. But yeah, we're just walking back. We'll probably nip to a supermarket and get a few bottles of water as we need a few in the room and the girls are really thirsty. If someone had told me that I will take off Oh my gosh, I look so orange in this light. I don't know why I look so orange, guys, but sorry, I'll just have to deal with it. It's this orange light here. It's very bright and very orange. We just got back to our hotel room and we are all just settling down for the night. It's just gone half past nine. As we've already explained, we're not, we're not a family who do evening entertainment. It just doesn't interest us, really. We'd much rather be in our hotel room all together play a game of cards or something fun like that and then read our book for half an hour before going to sleep which is what we are just about to start doing right now the girls are all just brushing their teeth and i'm about to end today's vlog chris is about to start editing i just have a special shout out to do and that is to jasmine jenkins age 10 from wales and I'm doing this shout out to Jasmine because her mum emailed to say that they have spent the last week, I think it said a week, in Mallorca, just close to where we're staying right now, or exactly where we're staying right now. And she was so upset to go home and see as soon as we, she got home that we had arrived and she would have loved to have met us and she felt a bit disappointed. Everyone feels disappointed going home from holiday. But she just felt really upset that she could possibly have met us and she didn't. So Jasmine, I hope you had the most amazing time on holiday and hopefully there will be an opportunity to meet you again in the future. But all the same, I hope you had an awesome holiday with your family. Also, just want to say a big thank you guys so much for your amazing 
comments on our new intro. I didn't even know Chris was going to be doing the new intro last night and I loved it and I think he did so good. He sat up until around 3am this morning doing that as well as editing the vlog. So big, big, big thumbs up to Chris for doing that and thank you guys so much for all your awesome comments and feedback. It means the absolute world to us. But for today, that's it. It's supposed to be a scorcher tomorrow. It's been around 27 degrees, something like that, 28 for the last few days. And that's been pretty unbearable for us. Anyway, tomorrow's meant to be 32 degrees. So that's gonna be really, really much of a pull day. <laughs> today guys thank you all so much for your amazing comments and for watching our videos we can't wait to share tomorrow's adventures with you and we'll see you all again tomorrow at 6 p.m